You see the spirit of UCSF School of Nursing in the first pictures. After San Francisco's earthquake in 1906, refugees flocked to the tent cities. Up here, UC Medical School converted part of its building to a hospital, then added a training school for nurses. The city rose again, and UC Nursing would rise with it. Today, 100 years later, the University of California San Francisco School of Nursing is the preeminent nursing school in the nation. The school pursues three missions, caregiving, providing excellent patient care and redefining it, education, preparing nurses and nurse educators, and research, developing new knowledge to improve health care delivery. It really is the most amazing place I've ever seen. What we do here is improve the health of Californians, all Californians. And UCSF leadership has helped the nursing profession become a success story of health care. Today, nurses account for more than half of all health care providers. And nurses are health care leaders, public health advocates, and researchers. How did all this happen? When UC opened its training school for nurses in 1907, there were no degrees, only diplomas, and the focus was solely on hospital training. But it was the dawn of a demanding time. A global flu epidemic was coming, and two world wars. These events allowed nurses to play a big role, and public awareness of their work rose. You also see a defining quality of nursing emerge. When healthcare needs arise, nurses respond. And so as needs grew, the School of Nursing grew. Today, UCSF prepares nurses in over 20 master's and doctoral fields, ranging from trauma care to community health. The school stands alongside one of the nation's top 10 medical centers, so excellent patient care is taught and practiced side by side. Example, Cammie Lennett. She's a nurse in UCSF's medical center and a master's student in oncology in the School of Nursing. I work with some really excellent caregivers. And at the same time, I'm able to pursue an advanced degree from some of the best educators in nursing. So I think this combination is really going to enable me to make a big impact on healthcare. Today's UCSF School of Nursing takes caregiving to the new front lines, to its Valencia Clinic in the Mission District. I feel my son Gracias. To classrooms teaching diabetics and their families to manage the disease together, to San Francisco's Tenderloin. Here, in the clinic at Glide Memorial Church, UCSF nurses treat the so-called walking wounded, 3,000 poor and homeless a year. Here's a group of people, nurses, who talk to the people, plan with them, and make sure that those folks are always taken care of. Real care, I'm talking about whole care. All these nursing initiatives prove one thing. In this age of managed care and technology, nurses are the human face of health care. Those first nurses were taught by the director or graduate nurses or professors from other fields. There were no nurse professors, not yet. But slowly, nursing took root in the university. In 1939, the UC Training School became the first autonomous school of nursing in any public university. And all the while, the school was producing leaders. Sarah gomez Erlock wrote legislation creating migrant health clinics in California. Marilyn Chow became a vice president of Kaiser Permanente. And Shirley Chater appointed secretary of the Social Security Administration. Today, this commitment to prepare leaders positions the school to confront America's newest challenge. We're living longer and requiring more care. By 2020, we'll face a shortage of 800,000 nurses. There's a big pool of talented people who could become nurses, but won't, because we haven't reached our diverse populations, or we don't have enough professors to teach them. We want to change all of this. And so, UCSF is breaking new ground partnering with an undergraduate school to offer a single pathway to bachelor's and master's degrees, offering a master's entry program for people with degrees in non-nursing fields. And thanks to a generous grant from the Gordon and Betty Moore Foundation, 
enabling future nursing educators to earn their doctorates in just three years. I've always wanted to become a nurse educator and the more fellowships making it possible for me to do at this point in my life. I had such fantastic nursing mentors that that's what motivates me to become one for the students of the future. We're creating novel solutions to the nursing shortage, solutions the rest of the country can emulate. That's the mark of a great school. In 1932, UC professor Edith Bryan proposed scientific research in nursing. The idea was so unusual, few people could even conceive of it. Not today. There's a few more questions in front here. UCSF nurse Carol Meriton researches pain and learns things only a nurse would learn. We're on the front line, and I honestly believe that patients tell us a lot more than what they tell a physician. Her findings help School of Nursing researchers understand how pain affects healing. Nursing is interested in understanding the whole person and how the disease, how their treatment affects things like their mood, their quality of life, their ability to function, so it's a good fit. You can have your family members come and visit. Um, what they learn from patients helps UCSF nurses pioneer entire new fields in health care and policy making. The point of research is to improve people's health care. For example, in my area of HIV AIDS, people's willingness to report their illness and maintain their treatment varies from culture to culture. So all the medicine in the world won't help if we don't address these differences. No wonder among the nation's nursing schools, UCSF ranks number one in research grants from the National Institutes of Health. I'm pleased to be here today to officially kick off the UCSF Nursing Centennial Celebration. The UCSF School of Nursing, celebrating a century of excellence in patient care, education, and research, and providing the human face of healthcare. You could say our first hundred years were spent demonstrating all that nursing has to offer. We're poised to continue our tradition of excellence throughout the next century. I can't think of any better way to give back to the community than through nursing. To me, it's a privilege to be a nurse, especially a UCSF nurse.